Alright, welcome back. We're going to continue on our search for the Forest Witch Malia. Um, should be relatively close to finding her. Uh, we've been wandering through this forest, apparently, that has not been touched by humans. So, deadly, deadly strong creatures are supposed to be afoot here, but it's not really what I'm trying to do. These enemies are actually really easy and not hard or annoying at all to deal with. So we're both gonna go into Giga Cal Recovery. Alright, let's jump up. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Dun, dun, dun. Squeak, squeak! Aw, oh, she's still a mouse. Damn. Oh my, do you think that's the forest switch? Squeak! Chew. Uh oh. Chew, squeak, chew! Ah! Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. The paper is exactly where that strange mouse was just located. Uh. Hey, Honey Knight, pick that paper up and bring it back so I can get a nice look at it, okay? The Hundred Knight snags a thick piece of paper with writing on it. Thick paper required. Um. So is that all we have to do here? If that is the case, I'm a little upset because I boosted up all my stats and now what we need to do is proceed to the checkpoint. Oh. Alright, let's go back. Oh, I think an area that way maybe? Woohoo! It's over here. Probably not. Just more of these stupid giants. Good 
bye. I think if he kills it, I don't get credit, so... Alright, let's just go back to the pillar. There's no sense in continuing. Ah! Alright, pillar. Hey, is there anything up this way? No. Okay. So let's go back to the base. Return to base. Yep. With our 11,000 experience. Okay. And I think we got everything in here too. Alright. Whatever. We'll keep our garbage. We don't care. As you use a weapon, you gain XP for that weapon. After a certain amount, it'll level up and your attack power for that weapon will increase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're back, Hunter Knight. Did you find the forest switch? Master Monty seems to believe that the mouse purported to be pur purported to be Master Malley was snatched by a bird. What? What? But then the party. Hey, relax, buddy. Let's see the paper you picked up earlier, Honey Knight. Hunter Knight hands Visco the paper. Huh? What's this? Th isn't this a boarding pass? How suspicious! But it's just as I thought. That's a train ticket, and its destination is the nighttime soiree. Does that mean you can get to the party if you have that ticket? Amazing! Great job, Hundred Knight! Let's tell our master right away! Oh my! What an emotional roller coaster! He's a silly boy, huh? I do hope this improved Master Leah's mood, but. Huh? That was quick. What happened? I'm sure she's in her room, but I didn't get a response. Hmm, I figured as much. Not like she'd want to go out and party even with those witches after what they did to her. Either way, I knew she wouldn't want to accept something that the forest witch gave to us. A fair point. Uh, so like, how do my master and the forest witch know each other? Yeah, can you fill us in? I'm a little foggy on the details myself. All I know is that Leah hates, hates, hates our buddy the forest witch. Is it a long-standing grudge? I wouldn't say that exactly. We can gossip about it later, okay? We gotta find a way to drag Leah out of her room. About that, I have a question. As long as we have that ticket, is it possible for me to attend the party myself? Huh? What's this, Visco? You wanna find the witch that cursed you? Or are you gonna go fight him? That, that's definitely not it. I'm not evil like Metallia. Our goal is to make the witches who are attending the party acknowledge Metallia as their peer, right? Uh, so are we gonna tie them up and force them to accept her? Jeez, why do you always take things in an evil direction? I meant that I could try to negotiate or something. Once you receive the approval of the other witches at the party, you can officially be invited to attend it. Aw, oh, you're so naive, Visco. You're like a sheltered princess. Uh, really? I don't... You don't think it'll work? Who knows? Witches have a whole lot of pride, so they're pretty darn cold to newbie witches. Do you think they'd acknowledge her if you went and asked on her behalf? I mean, like, really? But, we won't know unless we try, maybe. Uh-huh, that's true too. 
Not like we have some other genius plan, right? So, who's all going to go? The train, sec the train ticket says it allows for two guests. Honey night, duh! I mean, it's such a good little scrapper and all. So, we're assuming we'll end up having to fight them, I see. <laughs> we're assaulting the enemy's base, so it doesn't really matter if we show up smiling or scowling. And, I mean, if there's a pillar nearby, he can release the swamp from inside it. Uh, doi! Uh, okay, so it gets to go, but who's the second person? You look like you really want to go, but I think this job is more suited to the lovely Visco. Yeah, I guess. In that case, I'll need to ask how you go about using this ticket. I believe that a unique train station exists where the night train takes passengers to the party. Or not. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We already ran across a suspicious station of some kind. Remember Honey Knight? That station in Hekahene Forest? Please go on ahead of me, Hundred Knight. I'll get my things together and meet you at the station. Let me explain. Girls tend to worry about how they look if they're going to a party, Honey Knight. Uh-huh. Uh, let's see if we got anything worthwhile. So we have cunning, no wait, beheading sword, that's, oh it's rare, or it's um, blunt. So if we actually had it in the 4 slot it wouldn't be terrible. In the 1 slot, I don't know, we do have already a lot of slash, and it's 300, and this is epic, so we'll do it, whatever. Let's see what this looks like. Well, it's still a nice swing for initial. Okay, and that gives us two blunt, one magic, two slash. Which isn't terrible. Um, alright, so let's head over to the train station. Hopefully we remember how to get there. In the Hekahene Forest or something. Hekahene. Hekahen. Dodge actually takes up an AP, which I did not know. Um, but I do know now, so it's good to know. Uh, let's see. 
No! That's not where I wanted to go. Damn. What is this even? What the hell's even up here? Uh, another junkie. Damn it. I think I went where I wasn't supposed to go. Now I'm getting lost. Oh, well, there is a thing in your chest. The black box. So, I guess worth. Nanaba! Nanaba! Green spear, which I've already full on. Whatever. Uh, I hate backtracking. If I don't have to. Damn it! I keep messing up. I keep thinking I'm going the right way, and I'm clearly not. Um, I really made it there. Oh, there's no jumpy, jumpy. All right. So this way, maybe. I really don't know which way to go. Oh, this is the pillar. Oh, and I see a box up there. How do I get up there? Jumpy jumpy's there. Is there another jumpy jumpy? Uh, there's probably it's probably in here. Yes, 
it was that fun. Excellent. Alright, let's see what happens here. are destroyed over this way. This line must not still be in service. Huh? What's that bell? Moku? <laughs> As if a train would just appear if you rang it. Train? From out of thin air? Rawr! The night train is here. We're headed to the Walpurgis party. Wow, the heck a hen at four stop. This place takes me back. What an oddball of a great witch. Summoning the train here of all places. Huh? I don't see a great witch anywhere. There's just this fat little thing and a dog human. What is this? What's going on? Do you know? What? Oh, wait. Maybe that little thing rang the bell? Do you really have a ticket? Is it a forgery? Can I nibble on it? So the Hunter Knight chucks the ticket into the goat's mouth. It's the real deal, even though they're not witches at all. You'll let these weirdos board? There's no way. Seriously, give me a break. Will you give me a break? No way. The atmosphere is getting all thunderstormy. But this is fine, too. Maybe this type of thing really pumps me up? So what are we going to do? Can we eat them? Please, can we? I can swallow them both whole. Hey, Hundred Knight, what should we do? I'm sure you won't be killed, Honey Knight, but I don't know if I can say the same about Bisco. Can you do something about her? You know, to keep her safe? What, what was that? Some kind of message from Moni? Oh! What the... Oh. Well, that's a first. I wonder what we should do. Hey, non-witches burn up if they try to get on us. I don't want to deal with that. Yeah, me neither. It's not in our contract. We can only take the great witches. You have a contract with the witches? Enough thinking. Let's eat first and think some more later. Yeah, that sounds great. So he says. Sorry, but we can't let you on. Please leave in a calm manner and without complaint. Oh, crap, we're actually gonna fight this thing. I was not expecting that at all. Um, so, I think we're actually going to... <laughs> Let's see, what are we gonna do about this? Uh, so, we can summon the turret. One here. And then we wanna summon. Oh crap! We didn't want that to happen. And we'll summon another one here. Um, and then. The mini knight. <laughs> and. Oh, we can't put in a time bomb, unfortunately. Alright. That's fine. Hmm. 
not really quite sure what to do. Can't get too close to it. It's oh, there's a switch here. I didn't even see that. Resonates with Metallia's increasing magic power. Another facet has been born. Woohoo! So we got the Shinobi Assassin facet. Okay. I'm assuming that's good. So stage Kaliru. Uh, yes, we all leveled up. Perfect. And here are our bonuses. Um. And I actually think this is probably a good point to stop. So next time we'll see what happens with the train, if it lets us on or what. Thanks for watching.